Good morning everybody. Um, my name is Rita Hanninen. I'm the event director for Raising the Planet Ecuador 2015 and I'm currently here in Ecuador very close to the uh, Cotopaxi Nas National Park uh, at a small town called Tilpulo. And here with me I have Carlos Casia Prieto who's the course director for the race. Carlos, could you tell us a little bit about the race and, and the course? Uh, a little bit is uh, I, I have to say many things about the you, course. You can say many things. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, Ecuador is going to be very different. We, uh, I think, we it's nice to have like different uh, environments for uh, every every race, and uh, and Ecuador is going to be very different from the other ones. I think the main the main thing or the main thi uh, different thing from the other races are the volcanoes. We will have uh, we will be running very close to uh, to many volcanoes in uh, in Ecuador actually the start line will be very close to the Cotopaxi volcano one uh, that is almost 6000 meters elevation mm -hmm. we are going to be lower though and um, and then we will be passing by the Ilininsas we will be passing by the Tumburawa and uh, we will be seeing the Tumburawa so uh, it's going to be very different from from uh, the other races that uh, at least the beyond races that racing the planet has done so Great. it's very interesting what other highlights are competitors going to be seeing on the on the course well uh, i think uh, well, the highlights are many many uh, many things i can uh, i can think about many things but the main thing i think i i can think of is the relationship with the, with the population? I, it reminds me. This race reminds me a lot as the the first uh, uh, beyond uh, or Robin race that we did is Vietnam, mm -hmm. and uh, we were very much in contact with the local people. And uh, and in, in this race we will also be very much in contact with them. Uh, you have to think that Ecuador is one of the is the the most densely populated uh, country in South America. So it's, it's, it's really hard to find places with no one mm -hmm. and um, we do our best but anyway I think, it, I think it's nice to, to be in touch with the local people and in Ecuador we will, so the, I hope they, everybody will enjoy it. Perfect, I'm sure they will. <laughs> okay, thank you very much. Yeah, so we'll see you in July uh, 2015. Bye -bye. See you next year.